Yeah, so this is the gauntlet. I have no idea how to handle this. I think we just have to go fight a boss that will be Fiendfolio based. We'll get money and we can just buy uh, an item, I guess, right? What in the hell are you? <laughs> ah! I don't know anything about Fiendfolio, dude. Also, I do not start with a bomb like I used to do as Isaac. Do I go into the boss right away? I'm a little nervous. Excuse me? We went from the basement to the cellar. I just went down another floor. Is it really like that? Interesting. I wonder what's in here. See, I don't know anything about this, right? All I know is the gauntlet has a set seed uh, and it's Fiendfolio enemies and it's always the same the exact same time. So if you get good enough, in theory, you can just do every single thing. Oh my lord. We've hit the honeycomb floor full of sweets and goodness. I, I suppose we'll just fight the first boss we came across, right? I mean, this is the basement. Basement bosses are typically easy rather than alt bosses. What the hell are you, Buck? Okay, I'm gonna try my best to just uh, understand how the enemy works right away and dodge. This is also kind of why I wanted to do, uh, do this, because it's fun to learn new enemies. What is that? Okay, this guy shoots into a giant burst. We gotta kill him. Almost walked into a bomb. That was terrifying. This guy seems pretty easy, though. He's only a basement boss, right? We don't have to worry about it. How many coins do you get when you beat the boss is the real question. This guy seems very important to kill, in my opinion. From my limited knowledge with this buck boss. Oh, I see. He gives him a giant tear and then he goes crazy and does the eight shots. I see. I understand. Can I get the finishing blow just randomly? Does this kill the entire- what, what? He has a bomb in his mouth. Back up! He's got a bomb! Ah! Alright, he's done for. We took one hit of damage. Whatever. Not that bad. We get seven coins. And this key, I believe, lets us progress. So we gotta take this. Matt, what mod is this? This is the Fiend Folio mod. We don't have enough money for anything here, but I'm thinking logic- Oh, they got a homing? Okay, uh, logically, the best thing to buy here is homing, right? Uh, that's just more shots hit, that's better DPS. That, that'll that make it so I don't have to focus too much on offense, which is important because I want to focus on dodging, right? Because I don't know what these enemies do. The Whispers. Okay, hi, how you doing? They go around in uh, triangle circles? That is two different shapes, what am I saying? <laughs> Okay, they're going a little crazy. It seems pretty easy to dodge. Just go weave in and out though, right? Okay, just kidding. Okay, yeah. This this boss isn't actually that bad, I don't think. As long as you're good at weaving in and out. Which I'm just not, you know? <laughs> That's just how it is. <laughs> Wait, you can you can aim upwards. He has vertical abilities. Oh no, he has downward abilities too. Okay, done for. Whisper's done. A bit of a tougher fight for me, but you know, it's okay, whatever. Okay, so this is a little tough, right? I mean, we can heal. Ah, the best thing I can buy right now is Odd Mushroom, because that would heal me. Even if it's a speed down. I really want the homing though, but I'm assuming I can buy two items on this floor. So let's take this for now. And who are you? Honey Drop. Hi, Honey Drop. Never fought this boss before, but I do one-shot flies now because of my damage, so I'm feeling a bit more confident. Let's just keep our distance and uh, see what's happening, right? What is that? Oh, what is going on? I can't shoot it, it doesn't deal damage. Do I just hit you instead while that's floating around, I guess? What? Excuse me? <laughs> you good? You seem to be leaking right now, I don't think that's good. This is a really easy boss. Okay, I think the damage up was a very, very worthwhile pick for us. I'm feeling far more effective. Um, man, I really want homing. Okay, well let's just go around. We got Burning Basement now, so we have to have the Burning Basement boss. I believe I fought a Burning Basement boss the first time I tried Fiendfolio. It was like a nuclear dude. It was not you, I don't think? Uh, I'm gonna assume I probably shouldn't stay there. <laughs> okay, bros chucking fire. I assume when it hits that, it does a big boy thing. Yeah, okay, that's true. Seems pretty simple so far, right? This is just an alternate to Little Horn. It can't be that complicated. Okay, much, 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 much better fight. I say that as if it's not even done. It, okay, there you go. <laughs> Good stuff. More money, more key. I, I'm gonna do a risky play here and take homing. I know I'm low on health and I really want to buy these two, but assuming there's one more boss, I might be able to buy uh, that double heart. So we, I, I'm, I'm assuming that we have more bosses, right? Because we keep moving forward here, which is why it was okay to buy homing. What are you? I definitely have not fought Buster and his commission. So this is a little bit terrifying. <laughs> I'm gonna apply the same law. Don't stand horizontal because I saw him charge, right? What is this? What are they doing? Oh, I see. They're getting ready to ignite and explode. Ah, uh, pretty easy boss, except I ran right into the fire like a bozo. He's exploding! Get out the way! Have you ever tried Valorant? Yeah, I played Valorant, of course. I don't really like it that much as I, I like CS, but I think it's a cool game. Those guys were terrifying. Nuke man. This is the guy that I fought. Meltdown. I really like this fight. This guy's cool. Like halfway through the fight, he just turns into a nuke and, and just destroys everyone. 
I don't remember him spawning little tiny dudes, but I'm assuming he didn't get patched and I'm just, I don't know about the game. <laughs> okay, is this it? He, he, yeah, he gets mad and he's like, dude, boom. I'm a skeleton now. Careful. I know he's gonna do something with that. He's gonna wanna chuck it at me. There you go. And then the cool thing about this boss is you can see little streaks on the ground and that's how you can tell where the tears are going. Like this one that I'm walking on right now. While I was showing that, I got hit. I hate my life. Who are you? Ghost Buster and his emissions. I imagine this is a alternate to the Buster dude that we fought earlier. That guy was pretty easy, so I don't think this guy's gonna be too hard. Oh, okay, he hit me with a mix-up, unironically. Okay, he, uh, this guy has the ability to turn. He's got a driving steering wheel on his uh, inventory right now. Other than that, I think we're good. We don't need to do anything else. We learned about the boss, that's cool. Oh, he's sucking me! Get away! That was a magical experience. I'm very happy I, I got to experience that, thank you. I think I'm just gonna buy a heart and hope the next floor's items are a little bit better. I gotta admit, I'm not excited for whatever the Drost Fiend Folio boss is. Cockamancer! Never mind, it's the best boss ever conceived. Does he have a little sci-fly in his head? Like, what's going on over there? I'm gonna assume I probably should just hit that. There you go. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, he TP'd. Okay, Kaka Mancer. What? Well, Kaka Mancer. Kaka Monster. Kaka. What is his name? Kaka, dude. He isn't that bad. He has the longest death animation in history, so, dude. <laughs> There's nothing else here that I really want. Okay, I I'm just gonna keep doing what I was doing. Let's just save our stuff. Okay, is this is this the end game? I guess I just did it in the right order, right? So I use all these little key ghosts, and then I believe we get to go to the next floor. I'm sorry, we are already in the caves. There was no like screen transition or anything. Um, let's go little Steven for now. And then I might go bone heart, uh, double heart play. As I think there's also secret rooms in this. If you just know where the secret rooms are, you can just break. But we're going at this uh, very vanilla like, okay? I'm gonna do this boss first. Apply the same logic I did last time, where this is a caves boss. So, logically, it has to be the easiest. They took the bat and they made him even fatter. I really like how Isaac bosses do that, by the way. I think that's the coolest thing. Like, Mega Maw or Mega Fatty. Just like, a boss is a giant version of a regular enemy. I always like that trope in video games. I'm getting swarmed right now. Don't hurt me. Seems pretty easy, right? Just spawns a bunch of bats, which I have high damage for. And then charges from the top of the screen. Not too bad. Ow. Just kidding. He spawned a fat butt right in my face, don't do that. Alright, thanks for the money. Kingpin. That is a godlike name and sprite. Also, I'm terrified. Is it two? It is two. It's just a bunch of segments, they come at me. Seems pretty simple so far, I'm waiting for like a mix-up. They seem to leave tears behind, so I need to be wary of where I'm going. I got hit? No way. Ow, damn it, I got hit again. That's- Oh, I'm about to die! All right, we're good. I gotta go buy hearts. Stream Mario 64. I was gonna do like Mario 64 speedrunning for fun. I've watched enough uh, Mario 64 speedrunning casually to know how to play the game. I'm pretty sure that's just how it works. Give me this tough love. What are you? Slinger. What are you supposed to be? <laughs> what, what are you? Oh, he gave me a thumbs up. Actually, he's a cool guy. I like this guy. Chucks his head. Interesting. Tough love has given us such an immaculate damage up. It's so noticeable, dude. This will also give me a cool lick into every single Fiend Folio boss. I'm assuming most of them, if not all, are here. He went web mode. He's actually invulnerable now. This is his strongest ability. He's done for. That guy was really easy. Okay, looks like we've hit the flooded cave section. Got a couple lily pads here. Just move on. Interesting that that is a mechanic. What happens if I fall? I'm assuming I take damage like uh, Legend of Zelda style, right? Link to the past. I'm not going to test it, though. What about you? Monsoon. You look awesome. <laughs> Did he just- what? I'm sorry, I just got so mixed up. He phased into the ground and then just came from the ceiling. Nothing could have prepared me for that. Look, he did it again. Look, what, what, what is that move? He's doing it more! This guy seems really hard, actually. At least in comparison to Slinger. I- I don't want to know what this move is. Just die. <laughs> Alright, I have to do this boss without getting hit. Like, maybe two, three, four times. I think I can do it. Aqua Gob. Hello, Aqua Gob. I saw three of you on the sprite screen. You can't trick me. I know more about to spawn. Only thing he's done so far is shoot triple shots, which are absurdly easy to dodge. I, is it over? Aqua Gob down. Wait, he's, he's, he's TP! Aqua Gob down. For real this time. That guy was easy. 
Someone said in chat, get a uh, baby freaking joined, but I'm, I I can't go back. I can't get demon baby anymore. Is the playing card worth it? I don't know. I, wait, it's seated, right? Chat, have any of you ever done this before? Is the playing card worth it? <laughs> yes, it is worth. It's Joker. It's Joker. Boom. I just got baited. <laughs> it does seem worth it though. I mean, Ace of Hearts is big, right? I'm kind of cool to just go full on damage and then just try and dodge. There's Steven, just regular Steven, and a couple of- Oh my god, this is the place to be, dude, what? These items are nasty. I'm gonna buy the health and then go tech two, maybe Steven if I can afford it. This is assuming I don't get hit enough. I'm not fighting this guy right away, because this is Mausoleum. And the last thing I want to do is fight a Mausoleum Fiend Folio boss. That's probably ass. That's Womb, so that's the place I need to go, so I assume I have to go bottom right here, right? Okay, so here's our depths boss. This this guy will probably be a lot easier than whatever mausoleum was cooking. Bada bing, bada boom. Organization. I get it, they're organs. They're kind of just moving along. Okay, cool. What is that thing on the bottom right? It's about to block my path. Do I have to kill it? I'm assuming I can't touch it. I'm playing Pac-Man currently. That guy has a charge attack, good to know. All right, all right, understood, understood. So we gotta kill the brain dude and watch out for the charge attack guy. I don't know what this guy does. He looks like me, but he's blushing in a ghost and I think that's adorable. No, oh, bozo play, my bad. I totally whiffed on the, the charging guy. There he is, watch out. Please, uh-oh, like one hit. How are you alive? I shot you like five times or one HP. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Everyone dies far away from me. I'm feeling better, there you go. Let's go get tech. Let's buy this and keep moving. Next time I need hearts, we'll do that. There's another tinted rock right there. I'm assuming this is a tinted rock. Obviously, I don't know what uh, fiend folio tinted rocks look like, but I've seen a couple. You are large and in charge. He reminds me of a, a Blado block character. Okay, so the, the tears that he spurts out burst into X's. Gotta be aware of that. I am the great gold This is like that Gertie type of fight, but uh, we got it done. Getting only hit once on this guy feels good. Can't you use ace on enemies? Oh, that is a good idea. There are no enemies here. <laughs> what about here? There you go. Boom. I pressed Q, I swear. I'm press I swear to god, I'm pressing Q, it's not working. I I'm not even kidding. I I I I I'm going to go in real life and film my pre self pressing Q. I think maybe it locks you out and you're not allowed to do it in rooms. But that shatter almost got me killed. <laughs> Alright, what about you? Warp zone! Okay, a little bit of warpage in my area. Dodge that, that's okay. Spawned a, like a weird Larry Jr. hollow hybrid. That guy looks cool. That makes sense, right? Because if you didn't know, uh, the Super Meat Boy boss Larry is literally just Larry Jr. but the original. Oh my lord! What is that? A tear effect, stop! <laughs> I didn't want to say anything, but I was so terrified. He's picking up Gemini? That was sick. No, there's more. Wow, Warp Zone's a hard boss, huh? This guy's cool, though. Continue to do nothing, please. This is just straight up, like, Toho dodging. This is easy. And then if I manage to get uh, 10 more cents, which I don't think I can, right? Because 2 plus uh, 7 is 9. I would like to buy the Bone Heart. How about you? Another Mausoleum boss? Dusk. It's uh, the hands from Mario 64. Oh my god, it actually is. What in the hell is this? How do I dodge? Oh, what's going on, man? What is this? Okay, this is by far the hardest fight. I don't know what's going on. Maybe like experience issue, right? But like, what? how do I dodge this? What is that? Maybe I don't understand the boss. <laughs> okay, done, right? Please, maybe? He's gonna charge me again. Okay, I, I kind of understood at the very end, but that was a hard one. Do we ace a hearts this? Yeah, we do. You know what we do? What is that? I don't know, but I picked it up. Uh, and then we're gonna buy the bone heart. I cannot express enough how important it is that I have homing tech because it makes this so much easier to just like not focus on anything but dodging. Like I'm just holding down a button, appreciating the cool animations and trying to sight read and it's really fun. I, I, I don't really know what's going on to be honest with you, but there's sister viz in my way. What? Oh, I see, I see. There's like a little tell. There's like a little shing and it tells me where she's coming from. Oh man, this boss is destroying me. You gonna do anything more or do I get to just kill you in time? Nope. Yeah, you gotta hit in. That sucks. Okay. Well, that boss literally sucked, but that's why we use the Ace of Hearts, right? They get a little bit saved. Oh! Oh my god, that guy just like nuclear throne came out of the uh, like wazoo police. For those of you that know, you know. Luncheon. Is this a tapeworm reference? 
I, maybe I'm disrespecting, I don't know, but I, as far as I know, this is a Tapeworm reference, right? Uh, Tapeworm is Edmund's uh, another board game that he made on top of Four Souls. This is the most chaotic boss fight I've ever been a part of. But we did it! Nice, cool Tapeworm reference, dude. Alright, this is Dank Depp's boss. Pollution. I know this guy! I swear to god, I, there's like a video on this guy that has like 7 million views and everyone watched it for some reason. I don't know the fight by heart, obviously, because I don't remember watching that video. But I swear I saw this guy before. Dude, he's sick. Oh my lord. Look at him go. Oh, he ate shit. That sucks, dude. <laughs> Ow! I don't want to lose my bone heart, so let's be careful here. He actually gained health. I do remember this part. I think he just spurts a lot and then charges at you and then does the exact same thing again. And that's literally the entire fight. Yeah, okay. That, that wasn't bad. That guy's cool, though. I love his design. Poison seems like the next best thing here, right? Just like extra tick damage. Uh, I'll easy Cupid's arrow sucks. BFFs would affect only little Steven. Let's go for poison here. Who's my favorite class in TF2? I play Spy. I love Spy more than anything. And if I want to like actually be competitive, I'll play Scout. Oh, I might have enough money actually. Looks like uh, we have this boss as well as down here. So that means we will be able to buy Dumpy. It's okay. Oh, they put a football in the game. Junk star. We got another Gertie boss fight here. I'm just going to assume that I can just hold the direction and maybe that floating football head will not hit me. Ow, what the hell? Oh my lord. Stop. I just took so much damage. What was that move? <laughs> oh man, I wish I knew what that move was so I could register what was going on. I was getting pushed into the spikes like crazy. We got one more area down here. What are you? Sar. I'm assuming I said that right. Hello, Sar. I feel like I've vaguely seen this boss too. I think he goes in the sewers and he like melts down. That is correct. I don't know what happens afterwards though. Okay, he just pops out and shoots a tear barrage. That's kind of easy to dodge. Gotcha. I'm gonna take care of this ball first. It seems important. Or maybe that's just his health. Oh no, that was him. I, I was killing him. That was an easy one. Nice, good stuff. We can take this and now we can get Dumpy. Nice. Okay, this is actually going really well. All right, let's take this Dumperton. Uh, I'm assuming the card is okay, but I don't have money for it. Let's move on. This is where I get kind of scared, right? Because I'm assuming, uh, you know, Womb Fiend Folio is probably a bit of a dangerous combination. But we will try. Blood on the Martyr is immediately what I want. Lil Loki's cool. I want another Bone Heart if I can afford it. Uh, let's find Womb. What is this? Huh? Wait, it's the chest. This is the end? Oh, if I can get to the end? Okay, okay. Well, I'm way closer than I thought. Basco. Love that guy's name. Hello, Basque Meister. He's just rolling. That's just his entire deal. All he does is roll. He's quite the gamer. Oh, he spawned some things and I'm dodging some things, but nothing too terrible so far. Ooh, okay. I'm ready. Hi, Basco. I know, I know. Can I step on this creep? I can. Do, 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 You're dead. Uh, this is utero textures, right? <laughs> I actually can't tell. I know this is womb. So this is scarred womb? Okay, this is... No. I'm confused. <laughs> no, wait, these are both utero. Oh, these are both utero. Okay, 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 okay. The sun. Like the card? What? What is this? How do I handle this situation is the real question. Okay, you can't actually hit it. They, uh, okay, they actually put Gideon in the game. They made Fiendfolio Gideon. This boss is a lot more fun though. Looks like one of them just spawns brains every now and again. There's one that kind of orbits around and shoots tears at me. That was the closest dodge I've ever had. And this guy just leaves a trail of tears. That's actually pretty easy. It was a really fun fight though. Cool, bye son. You gonna heal me? That would have been epic. Gideon, but good. Dumpy's carrying. Dumpy is doing a lot by just being a presence right now. It does feel pretty good sight reading these uh, bosses though. It's really fun to learn more about uh, bosses and uh, enemies and such. While knowing literally nothing, never fighting these guys ever before and just kind of figuring it out. Dumpy's the reason you didn't take any damage. I will give some credit to Dumpy. I'm not gonna discredit him. Thank you, Dumpy. It's the peeper, but it's so large. This is a terrifying wall. Are you gonna shoot lasers at me? Because if you shoot lasers at me, you're the worst. I hate you. Okay, no, it's just a bajillion different tier effects. Give me this Dumpy back. Dumpy's actually going to be so essential on this fight. He just saved me two hits already. Do I have to hit these things on the ground? In the corner? I don't know. I'm just gonna keep hitting the boss, I think. Because they're not taking any damage. Dumpy just saved me like so many hits. Come on, Dumpy. Just keep just keep going. <laughs> Dumpy, thank you. I also realize I'm taking full hearts of damage now, right? Because I took a full hit there. That was scary. Definitely definitely hard carried by Dumpy just then. Is this Cacophobia? The, the like infamous boss? Oh boy. They got sands on the tail. Yeah, I'm not really afraid of this. I'm more afraid of like the tear effects that you might shoot at me. This is a, a this is the reaction check boss. 
How good are my reactions? Let's see. Oh, I'm kind of gaming. My reactions are immaculate. Uh, did I get hit the last second? That sucks. Whatever. Hey, it's me. Cool. The boss is so sick. Honestly, Cacophobia is definitely one of the coolest bosses. Sans and Isaac. I'm a little bit nervous. Do I buy bombs? Wait a second. There's bombs here. Is that like a fool's gold or a tinted rock? Let's look around for a bit. This would be the one time they actually don't put a tinted rock in, right? When they actually give you bombs. That'd be so troll. Anything? No. Oh god, this corpse boss scares the crap out of me. Alright, well let's just go. I mean, there's nothing else I can do. I could maybe buy those bombs, but whatever. Boom. Mr. Dead. Incredible name. Oh, it's Mr. Fred! Oh, it actually is an incredible name! <laughs> uh, as soon as he, I see him do anything, I'm just moving. It, actually, he's just aiming the wrong direction. I was assuming he would aim for me, but we're good! Mr. Dead. Ah, it's like a little dude controlling Fred. What a cool concept. He spawns tiny Tomas. The tech 2 is demolishing right now. There's just nothing this guy can do. This was actually the easiest fight on the floor. Don't stand there, because that's going to do something. Cool! Such cool tier effects, look at that dude! Oh wow, this mod's sick. What do you guys think, Little Loki's worth? I don't know. <laughs> Bomb Fool's Gold. Where's the Fool's Gold? There's no Fool's Gold. Oh, there is a Fool's Gold! Gimme, gimme. They're definitely gonna troll me. This is a, a complete bait. I guarantee you, it's gonna spawn three coins. There is- uh, What did I say?! I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. It's so obvious. I knew it! It's so insanely obvious that they would do that. I'm- I'm- I'm gonna tell you that I predicted that. I'm not taking blame. I'm blaming chat. I- I predicted that. It's so absurd that I got a soul read on you guys. You cannot trick me, fiend folio devs. Nothing else we can buy, right? I mean, I can buy a bomb, but nah. Alright, let's go. Chess pieces on the left and right. I just realized that. That's cool. What the hell are you? I don't even know what you do! Dumpy, I'm gonna need you for, like, all of this fight. Oh, I mean, might die. I think this is a mini boss you fight in Shoal that I just don't know anything about. We got it. We got it hit once. Kind of sucks, but I don't know. Oh, we can't go back. Uh oh. The cathedral fight. Nice. Wait, is this the end? This is literally the end. <gasps> dumpy. All, all you dumpy, please. He shielded. Seems like a similar fight to the other guy. Grave digger. Oh my god, did I do it? First try blind. Is there more? Is it a birthday cake? <gasps> Let's go. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I actually did it.